we filmed two makeup looks using only drugstore products. Yes. We used all different products and some of the products we'd never even used before. So it's kind of like a yeah. first impression. So if you want to know how we did it, then keep on watching. So we're going to start the makeup. Right. We are going to start with the primer. I'm going to um, clip my head out. This is a L'Oreal Infallible Mattifying Base. It's a mattifying primer. Um, oh! It's kind of like a silicone base. And I'm gonna use the Wet n Wild Matte. Matte. Matte Matte. It's like a face primer. And I'm gonna use that. Oh, that feels really nice. Okay. Um, I think we should use different foundations. So I'm gonna use the L'Oreal Infallible. Oh, actually, I'm using both Infallible products. Look. I'm gonna use the Infallible 24 Hour Fresh Wear foundation in the color 230. And I'm gonna use the new Rimmel Lasting Radiance. We just got this recently. And their medium coverage anti pollution foundation. And I've got color. Ooh, this is a nice color. I the color. What color is this? Ooh, nice. Oh, that looks good. This is nice. Oh, I'm looking for the color. It's right in the front. 103 True Ivory and 174 Silver Nine. So maybe this one. Let's see. This is so nice. everyday foundation you know if you don't want to use um, high-end foundation every day this is so nice I can't believe it I've never tried it look at my skin oh oh is it matte or glowy I'm not sure it's kind of mm. make sure you go all the way down here I'm gonna use the this is the LA girl contour stick velvet bronzer contour this Rimmel Insta Duo Contour Stick and Dark. Oh, I'm not that dark, but let's see. It's like a lipstick. That's an interesting Ooh. color, this. Yes. I think this color is suede. Nice and creamy, actually. same concealer. Which color should I use? 
I'm using I'm using called classic beige. Yeah, classic beige. It's a bit light. Yeah. But we don't have it just in that color. And I'm using this um, Real Techniques sponge. It's actually really nice. I love it. It's so soft and you can get it in drugstore. setting powder so I'm just we're just gonna use this LA girl pro high definition setting powder well actually this is a setting powder <laughs> yeah but it's very like it's the white one this is quite like a first impression because I didn't use many of these products yeah true I used the foundation before but the rest I haven't oh shadow I'm gonna use the Lottie London living my best life um, Twilly palette and this is our friend and she made the palette with um, Lottie and it's so pretty we used it before on a look and I'm gonna use it again but I'm gonna use the, the matte colors here creating a matte look I think I should use a different palette so I'm gonna use the new palette from Barry M and this is called Sandstorm very nice colors so let's do that I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna use like this light color here to try the eyes I'm using the color porky for the transition color just need to keep blending and applying more so this is darker it's been super windy in London recently. Literally everything is flying out of out of our balconies. Yeah, my pillows flew just literally somewhere. I have to find them and they're in the water. Just so I live on a ground floor, but I live in a tall building, so everything from the balcony is falling onto my like terrace where really? I live. Yeah. Today again something fell out. I get everything. Oh, you remember 
one time when the guy spit on your face. Yeah. <gasps> so dangerous, actually. Laura was standing outside, and some guy was on the, ba on the balcony, like on, I don't know, 10th floor, and just fat, and he went on her. He went on my face and my head. That was so funny. So yeah, that was nice. But I get weird stuff, like falling. I'm just using like these brown kind of shades. Just put it like a little bit. And I'm using all these, um, all these matte shadows to kind of like create a nice matte eye. With my finger, I'm just gonna use a bit of that white cream color. All right. For my look, I'm gonna use this uh, glitter eyeshadow from L'Oreal. And it's so pretty. Ooh. I wanna use this all over the lid. This is called Stardust in Paris. Look how pretty. Ooh, wow. I don't know if I should use my finger or I think I'm just gonna use my finger. Maybe. Oh. in Paris 01. Oh, nice. It's a glitter eyeshadow. You could even use this with a well you can see there. You can even use this with like a brush like make it wet for a more of a pigmentation but oh wow. Right for my eyeliner I'm gonna use this Lottie London stamp liner and it's actually fun because I just opened it and it's got a hard stamp. Oh it's there look it's got a hard stamp. I don't know if you guys see it. It's so cute. I'm gonna use this L'Oreal Perfect Slim Super Liner. Ooh. In the color black. In the color intense black. So let's go down. My hands are dangerous. But this liner also on the other side has like a normal liner. So I'm gonna use this for my liner. Okay, eyeliner is done, sharp and good. We shall do the mascara. For mascara, I'm using the L'Oreal Paris uh, False Lash X Fiber Mascara. And I'm gonna use the Rimmel Wonder Looks Volume. Ooh. This one has like two, two sides, number one and two. This is curved. Let's use the number one first. Ooh. Oh, holy moly! I actually remember our favorite mascaras used to be like things like this. Oh yeah, look at that! Whoa, that's a so serious, that's a serious volume there. And even mine, look at that! Look at that! Yeah, we have such a short lashes. That's fine. Okay, mascara is done. What's next? Next is... I don't know. We need to finish the face. So we kind of don't have any bronzer from drugstore. The only bronzer that we have that is kind of close to drugstore is BH Cosmetics. But we don't even know if it's drugstore or not, so sorry. But yeah, I actually couldn't find anything. But we need a bronzer, so... We gotta use something. Yeah. So which we're gonna use? Uh, we have two from BH Cosmetics. Uh, this is in the color Brilliant Bronzer in Coco Cutie. And this is Satin Bronzer in Tropical Pan. Hmm. I'll use... I'm gonna use both. Mix it, yeah. Bronze up the face. For us, bronzer is like the most important part. Yeah, it's funny because a few years ago, like five years ago, when we started doing our makeup, we'd never used bronzer. I mean, no, maybe more than five years ago. When we were se 17, so like 10 years ago nearly. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we only used foundation. 
no concealer, no bronzer, no highlight. You know, you remember the fashion. Give me some of the darker one. So I'm gonna use my favorite blush, and this is a Rimmel Maxi Blush in the color Sweet Cheeks. And it's like this beautiful peachy kind of coral color, and I use it actually, I use it like almost every day. I really love it. Well, I'm gonna use something different, and I'm gonna use the Rimmel London um, Blush Palette. It's like a, it's just Kate. Oh, it's designed by Kate Moss. <laughs> Rimmel London First Trio Blush Palette, exclusively designed by Kate Moss. They are a nice color. The one in the middle, it looks kind of like the. It looks the one in the middle looks like an orgasm from Nars. So that's like a good substitute for it. Oh yeah, that's a nice color. Next step is the highlight, and I'm gonna use the Maybelline Master Chrome Metallic Highlighter. And this is like the best dupe for like MAC Western girls. And like, I'm gonna have the same one and look how used mine is. Like, I literally use this all the time. And one secret, I use this on my legs <laughs> and my body. Ooh, but it's a great highlight. Like, this highlight, if you don't wanna spend a lot of money on highlight, this is the best one from Drugstore so far that we use. Mm -hmm. I'm also gonna use this highlight and put it in my um, inner corners. Oh, me too, actually, I forgot that. And on my brow bone. Yeah, we are done with the face, kind of. We are gonna use the lashes, and we're gonna use our favorite lashes, favorite of all time. These are Ardell Wispies, and we get them from Sally's, and this is like a but you can get them also in uh, mm -hmm. boots and stuff, yeah. But we get this in size because like next to my house and I get the whole pack of like five. Yeah. Five pack. Actually, we've been wearing these lashes these days like every day because they have a very thin band. So it's not like one of those main lashes that it's like you can feel the band on your eye. And yeah. we just prefer them more natural look these days. So these are, and they're still long. And they're really nice. Like these are my number one lashes at the moment. I wear them every day. We are back with the lashes on. As they can see, they're really nice. They're actually quite long, but and it super, makes a big difference. But they're super natural, so and super comfortable. So I guess to finish this look off, we're gonna do some lips. Yep. I'm gonna use my all-time favorite Rimmel lip liner in the color Addiction. This I used probably like. Not even exaggerating, maybe 30 of them. Really? Yeah. I'm gonna use something different and I'm gonna use this very old liner of mine from Gosh. I got this, I think, in Boots of Super Drug. I don't mm -hmm. know, don't remember. And it's in the color Nougat Crisp. 001 Nougat Crisp. And this used to be my favorite nude liner from Drugstore. And Literally, it's kind of like the color of our lips. A bit darker. This is so nice. Ooh, look at that liner. Oh, I'm gonna use this. This is called Stay Matte Liquid Lip Color from Rimmel in the color 720 Mocha with a C. Mo Mocha. Right, look at my liner. Okay. okay, so I'm just gonna use this on my lips. And I'm gonna use the new L'Oreal Paris Rouge Signature. I think it's like a liquid lipstick and they just came like two days ago. So I'm gonna use that one. And this is in the color Empower. I Empower, I think. It's the one Empower. 110 number. And it's got Ooh. such a nice brush. This is so Ooh. nice. Oh, it smells good too. Mm. Oh god, 
this one smells amazing. This is my first impression. So. Yeah. Oh my god, it's such a nice color. It's kind of like a peachy nude. Oh my gosh, I love these lips. Mm. It's so nice. And it feels like you don't have anything on your lips. It's so thin. I love it. They also have like red colors. I'm gonna use these next. So I guess this look is complete. Um, let I us know what you like think. I like this lip color. I like this lip color. I can't believe how nice it is. It makes your piece super white. Look, even mine. All right, we hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.